Hi everyone, so in the movement video we asked you at the end to create your own shape using the functions that we taught you, which were forward, backward, left, and right. And today I'm going to show you how you can do that. First I'm going to make a triangle. So I'm going to make one side and then turn the turtle to be in the direction of the next side. And I'm going to do that three times for each of the three sides in a triangle. So I already have my REPL set up like this, where T is the turtle. So first I'm going to write T.forward and then 100. But you can put any number of units you want depending on how big you want your shape to be. And next I'm going to turn my turtle left like this. And it's going to be 180 minus the angle in a triangle, which is 60. So it's I'm going to turn it 120 degrees, and I'll show you why that's the case. Alright, so let's say this is the triangle I'm going to draw, and I've already drawn this side right here. So my turtle is still going to the right like this, or facing to the right, and I need to turn it this angle right here so that now it's facing in this direction to be able to draw the next side. So in order to find what this angle is, you'll take the angle that's in the triangle, so in an equilateral triangle this angle is 60 degrees, and then subtract it from what this whole angle is, which is 180 degrees. So you're going to do 180 minus 60, because that's what's in the triangle here, and then that equals 120. So now you know that this angle right here is 120 degrees, and that's how much you'll be turning your turtle. All right, so now I'm back in my code here, and I'm going to put 120 degrees in that left function that we had before. So now I have one side here because I drew the side and then I turned it. So I need to take these two lines of code and copy and paste them two more times so we have enough for three sides. So press Ctrl or Command C to copy it, and then click down here and press Ctrl or Command V to paste, and do it two more times, so now you have a total of six steps. And now when I run that, you'll see I have a triangle. And we can do something similar for the square. So I'm going to first block out this code by putting three single quotes above and below it like this. So I'm going to start out the same way by making my side. This time I'll put 150 units, and remember you can put any number of units you want. And now I'm going to turn it, and this time it's going to be 180 minus 90, because the angle in a square is 90 degrees, so that is 90 degrees. So put that into the left function. And then you're going to copy and paste these two lines three more times, so you have four sides. So press Control C, then Control or Command V, just like that. So now you have eight steps here. And I'm going to run that. And you'll see I have my square like this. And I'm going to show you one more way to draw a shape using a new function. So I'm blocking out the code here. And the new function is just circle. So you write t.circle. And then inside the parentheses, you'll put the radius. So I'm going to make my radius 50 units. So that is how you make a circle in Python Turtle. And that is all I have for shapes today. I hope you try out some of these shapes or maybe try to make another shape that I didn't show you. And thank you for watching. Bye!